What's going on YouTube? Doing a tutorial for you guys today. And uh, the tutorial that I'm going to use do today is using an app called FlashCut. And what this app lets you do is it lets you put icons on your home screen with different icons than the usual. You can see on my home screen here, I have Pandora, Amazon MP3, Google, and Facebook. But those are not the regular stock icons. So once you do what you do is once you've downloaded FlashCut from the market, and it is a free download, you do a long press on your screen, and then once the menu comes up, select Shortcut, and scroll down to FlashCut and select FlashCut. That's going to load a list of your applications. Now once that's loaded up, I'm going to scroll down to, what do I want to use for this? I'm going to use Google just for this example. And I do have a lot of apps, so that's why you see a lot of stuff on the screen there. So I'm going to select Google, and then it's going to ask me how do I want to complete this action. The Flash is an artist who is pretty prominent in the Android community for making user interfaces and icons and the like. And he's also the mastermind behind FlashCut. So FlashCut integrates with his icon packs, which are called the Icon. I have three of those loaded up on my phone. You can see it's giving me the option to, of which one of those I want to choose. And the nice thing about this integration is that it'll take a best guess at which icon it thinks you want to use. So I'm going to select the, um, go with the Chrome ones here. And you can see it automatically pulled up the Google one. Another thing you can do is, if I select that, you could change the name if you don't like the name for whatever reason. And then you can also from here choose a different icon as well if the guess that it took wasn't what you wanted to do. So if I select choose a different icon, again it asks me which of those I want to use. And I have another icon pack loaded on here, but for this demonstration I'm just going to use the icons. I'm going to select the icon and then scroll down to the G's. I can do this fairly quickly here. And I passed it. So I'm going to go with this one. You can see it gives me that icon. If I hit OK, puts it on my home screen. It's changed the name. And just like that, you can have a nice customized uh, home screen. Those icons I have at the top are pretty nice and unique looking and it's just really easy you saw me do it here and it took me a very small amount of time to do again this was done using flash cut it is a free download in the market the icon that I used at the beginning which was the icon with the colors is a free download as well the other two icon packs the chrome one here you see at the top on these and the other one which is a bluish set of icons, are paid icon packs, but it is a nice way to support the artist. So I'll put links to all those in the description, as well as links to the app itself. And I will also be putting a link to the Flash's homepage and his Google Plus profile, which is a good way to get in touch with him regarding suggestions, or just to say, you know, hey man, good job. And uh, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like this in the future, go ahead and hit that subscribe button up top. If you have any questions, comments, or suggestions for me, uh, send me a message on my homepage, or hit me up on Google+, which I have a link to on my homepage, or shoot me a message here on my YouTube channel. Until then, enjoy customizing your phone with FlashCut, and take care.